Welcome to our monthly video announcements. At the end of each month, we like to highlight important information for the upcoming month. Don't forget to grab a November calendar on your way out today. We hope you enjoyed the extra hour of sleep you got this morning, unless of course you have kids or dogs or an internal body clock. For those of you who have that, we still have coffee available in the kitchen. This Wednesday night at 7 p.m., our midweek Bible study will be looking at some difficult passages in light of our culture. The homework for this week was to look at the following passages, which are also listed in your bulletin. These passages are 1 Corinthians 11, 1 through 16, 1 Corinthians 14, 33 through 35, Galatians 3, 24 through 29, and finally, 1 Timothy 2, 9 through 15. Make sure you study these passages and come on Wednesday ready for some lively discussion. On Sunday mornings in November, we will get to hear from a variety of speakers. Randy Schilling will be speaking the next couple of weeks, Bryson Orr will be speaking on the 15th, Tony Cosia on the 22nd, and David Schilling will be speaking on the final week of November the 29th. This month's distribution for the food bank will take place on Friday, November 20th from 10 a.m. to noon. Don't forget that today is our monthly contribution for the food bank. Looking ahead, our special Christmas food bank will take place on Friday, December 11th. Be on the lookout for our Christmas tree that is going to have tags with donation suggestions that you can get for this food bank. Just as an FYI, our building will be used as a polling place this Tuesday. Don't forget to go out and vote and make your opinions heard, whatever those opinions may be. Due to the Thanksgiving holiday, there will be no midweek Bible study on Wednesday, November 25th. We hope you use that time reflecting on all of the many things that we have to be thankful for. Again, we welcome you to celebrate Jesus with us today. We hope you feel spiritually uplifted by your time with us and are encouraged to go and put people over politics and remember who is truly in charge as we head into this emotional week. Stay quiet, I'm meant to be alive